Now this is content. Absolutely annihilated the enemy in a heroic victory. We've got ten grand's worth of prisoner, which we are going to execute. Execute. The witch king does it again. Who is this fucking bastard coming up to challenge the witch, witch king's hegemony over the land? <laughs> it's someone with a very low level of intelligence. And noble Captain Terrafin gathered his mighty militia, 450 brave souls, and he marched, ready to take part in the battle that had taken place last week. <laughs> And as he arrived and saw the great host of the Witch King Tyrant and his friend Captain Musgore, he said to his men, Do you want to have a go anyway? <laughs> Come on, we walked all this way. We might as well have a go anyway, he insisted. <laughs> and his men said, How dare you, Finn bastard. And he died. Yes, yes. Oh, he actually may have survived or executed the prisoners. The man himself may have gone away with that, which would be quite criminal considering what he just did. Derefin was backed into a corner. His only hope was the aid of one of the famous passport kings, riding him from behind. Well, I mean riding towards him from behind. Sorry, I've been on the internet recently. Um, let me just kill them all, will you? Oh, he didn't even get all of them. Well, no, oh, oh god. And then they, they moonwalked at incredible speed. The sonic booms were heard across Middle-earth as they moonwalked a path of flames to Dol Amroth. The path leading, of course, the Witch King to his very next target. Oh, bugger. There was a whole extra army down there, was there? Interesting. But not winteresting, is it? So, I don't know why. I came to besiege Dol Amroth, and an army's coming from down on the end of this peninsula. I think, you know, I think what happens is just if you attack the capital of a faction it just makes an army somewhere for them to come and like stop you from taking it so i think this has been spawned because the reason i think that is because it has citadel to guard and the last time we saw a unit of citadel guard was when i attacked minas tirith and suddenly a stack appeared to fight me i don't think that, that these guys the gondorians could even recruit citadel guard well they can't because we have their fucking citadel <laughs> guard this motherfucker so what this means is that my siege of Dol Amroth is going to have to be expedited. Actually, no, wait, I was going to say we need to get in before they arrive. Maybe we should let them arrive and do the old fight from all sides thing. Yeah, go on then. Go on then. Oh, right in my behind. Let's have a look at what you got. You got a lot, have you? You got quite a lot. Well, we can bring the Hadram in. Derefin's bloody alive. How dare you find yourself here, Derefin? Whatever. So, <laughs> there's so many of them. I'm sure this army must have spawned for free. Look at that, it's all leveled up. It's like units they can't even recruit. God, they must have been given this for free. Every step of the way in this campaign, <laughs> it's just been free, free, free stuff for the enemy. I mean, can we rely on on, on Captain Wackass? <laughs> that's some wackass shit, yo. That's what his face says as well. Last time on Mordor's Mangy March, I was fighting a decisive battle for the fate of Middle Earth. <laughs> the thing is, when I came to record today, I was like, oh, I remember now, I had to do another fucking decisive battle for the fate of Middle Earth. So I decided to gamble. I just said retreat from the battle, and uh, my guy retreated into this corner, and he's now completely stuck. So I might still have to fight it, because if this guy engages me, it will just be the exact same battle again. Um, but I thought if he just doesn't, I can bring down <laughs> the extra army. So that's the gamble. Will they bother to attack me? We're about to find out. Are we? Did I press it? Yeah, I did. Right, okay. That was surprisingly difficult. What the? What? What the? What the? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> wait, what? Hang on, what? <coughs> what? Who's, who's Egbert? An army of Ro a Ro had a war with me. Did I miss that? When did that happen? When did that happen? <laughs> Is this their first act of war? 
I didn't even know there's an army was just walking around him in his dirt, killing this general who was off going somewhere. Oh, I can just retreat, I guess. Don't attack me again. No, no! <laughs> oh, no! We're gonna lose some arbitrary general. And now there's an army in our back lines. Oh, no. See, my plan was very much dependent on not being at war with Rohan and conquering all of Gondor before they realized what was going on. But I don't know, it's some fucker lit those fucking beacons! <laughs> now Egbert here, King of Rohan, or... <laughs> I don't know what happened to Theoden. Theoden was here earlier. He came down, walked back, then thought, oh, fuck this, I'm sending Egbert. <laughs> Look, his helmet's shaped like an egg. The Gondorians went and killed Wackass, and for some reason I didn't reinforce them, so... Oh, look, it's Istnir, and he's standing right next to me. You might even say... No, all right, okay, all right. Looks like we have no choice in the end. So he managed to fight just their free reinforcement army rather than the free garrison army. So this should be better, although the balance of power is exactly the same as it was before, even with that whole stack taken out. I don't know what that's about. Anyway, we're going to have to fight this fight. It's Merinion. This guy's kind of like this, like Merinion. It's like the upgraded version of Merry. It's like a badass looking Merry. <laughs> you know what else comes in pints? Your blood! So, we're gonna have to fight him. Let's do it. Kill badass Merry. He's fighting there on the front lines against our spearmen like a fucking badass. Taking arrow after arrow, hacking away. If we kill him, the enemy will rout. He's like a level 9 commander. They're so reliant on him. What's that in the distance? Dwar of War, what are you doing? Oh, there's a fucking routing arch unit. Okay, just just keep doing your thing, Dwar of War. <laughs> you know what you're Dwaring out for. <laughs> So, yeah, I feel like we would win. There he is! Yes! I mean, yes! <laughs> the Witch King trying to hide his little gender-bending trick. <laughs> Not very well. So we're fine. He's dead. Are the enemy going to flee in panic, seeing their mighty leader fallen? No? <laughs> well, fuck. And the great warrior king, Badass Murray, found himself dead. Hey, hey, the music stop. Come back. There we go. This keeps happening. And the great warrior king, <laughs> Badass Mary, was defeated in open battle by the combined forces of Old Witch King, the of, 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 of Screamy Face, of Mange Meister, of DJ Skin Cancer, <laughs> and of oh! <laughs> combined at last. Although one of them's dead. Oh come on! <laughs> Come on, Council Nobles, you pedantic fucks. What is this? I see you have failed your mission to kill the badass Merry, known as Merinian. Well, he is actually dead. Uh, one of my orc spearmen killed him. This is the Witch King's voice. He's post-op now. <laughs> His secret got out, unfortunately. Well, you didn't send that weird German mange meister to kill him, so it doesn't. Count! <laughs> Just turning into Gollum. It doesn't count, says it doesn't! Can't believe they didn't hire me. So, what's the result of all this? We now have our reinforcement army and we can do a, draw, a siege draw out, maybe. Oh, we have to fight another. There's still going to be a decisive battle to decide the fate of Middle Earth. I think it's just going to be a bit easier now. Oh my god, let's look at the Rohan front first. They didn't really do anything. Who's this? Who's this? It's Aomer! What? Oh, he's let himself fucking go. <laughs> I'm, I'm the commander of the road here. We used to have a lot more horses, but they were just so delicious. I, just thinking about it, letting me salivate so much. I... <laughs> Anyway, so, <laughs> shall we kill him? Fat Aomer, <laughs> the greatest general after badass Mary. I, I just, I woke up one morning, and, and I thought to myself, I'm so hungry I could eat a horse. And I did, <laughs> and I've never looked back. Oh, uh, what's this? An enormous army of whatchamacallit is coming at me. <laughs> what do they taste like? Oh no, extra fuck, fuck us, Mr. Would you resolve it? <laughs> Master, we were supposed to order us off that battle. What are you doing? <laughs> there he is. Would he be proud <laughs> of Aemir today? I don't know how this servants of the... There's some kind of thing. It looks like it's an analogy to the Pope system in Medieval 2. You've got this servant of the Dark Lord thing. He's the Cardinal... 
Preferati, so <laughs> that's good. Hopefully he'll be made Pope soon. His name's Sauron. <laughs> Looks like a lovely chap. He's quite obedient. He's man's best friend. <laughs> How <laughs> ironic. Well, what's the world that man burns? We'll see about that. Back to the front line. Oh, yeah, I had to fight a decisive battle to decide the fate of Middle Earth, and I couldn't be bothered. Oh, no. No, no, <laughs> no. I sent this Nazgul to go and reinforce my assault on Rohan. Looks like Rohan spawned a massive garrison in fucking Aldborg there, by the way. Aldborg. And this army came out of nowhere. It's fucking Wilfred. He's got the alien swordsman and the Riddermark axeman and the Idrid lancers. What are we going to do? I can't retreat. Wormoth of Deer. Do you know Wormoth of Deer? <laughs> the mighty Nazgul. Or Mouth of Deer. Was forced to do battle with Wilfred the Hairy, <laughs> captain of the Hairy Guard. <laughs> it was a tragic day. They just keep coming. <laughs> I managed to do a decent amount of damage to one of their units by charging it, but they've got these lances and so we're not doing anything to them. It's over. <laughs> it's over. Poor oh, mouth of deer. <laughs> well, a last charge, a last charge. Uh, turn the music down. Turn the music down. <clears throat> we don't need the music for this charge. Charge! <clears throat> Home is behind the world ahead. And there are many paths to tread. Through Jedo to the edge of night Until the stars are all alight Mr. Shadow Man can't mind Who shall fade Oh, shall fade. Oh, that said, that thing actually went quite well, actually. Didn't you think? Didn't you think? Yeah, we actually got quite a lot of them. Ooh. Oh, we can run the time limit down, can't we? Ooh, now there's an interesting idea. Who wants to waste an hour of Devin's time? Shall I run the time limit down? Can't believe I did that. Okay. Amazing. So guys, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs>